I wish someone else saved my boyfriend's life. My boyfriend had a sudden cardiac arrest in our home earlier this year. One minute we were about to eat dinner, the next he was on the floor without a pulse. I called 911 immediately and administered CPR until the EMS arrived 13 minutes later. Boyfriend's alive. He has a brain injury he is still recovering from. I'm so glad he is alive and has another chance in life. I'm really glad I was able to do what I needed to so swiftly at the time. But I wish it wasn't me. My family calls me a hero. Doctors said he'd be dead if it weren't for me. Friends have too. I got a citizen life-saving award from our city's fire rescue. I look so miserable in the photos from that award ceremony. I can see how forced my smiles were and how dead my eyes were. And I still feel that way. It all feels hollow. I feel weird hearing all this. I know if my boyfriend were more aware right now, he'd be such a hype man. He'd call me cool. Of course, she's the one who saved my life. I'm glad it was her. We've been best friends for 10 years and I just know how he feels about me and how he would respond. Friends have told me as much and I know they are right. But I still feel hollow. I know that isn't how he'd want me to feel either. But I do. I've done a lot of EMDR and talk therapy over various traumas associated with that night and things that have happened since. It has definitely helped. But I still hear my screams in my head. I still see what his face looked like. I still feel his chest under my hands and his lips taking in the air from mine. I choked on food a while ago, legitimately could not breathe, and I panicked more thinking about my boyfriend's sudden cardiac arrest than the fact that I was maybe about to die. I just wish someone else was the one to do it, which sucks cause I don't want others feeling how I feel. I hate the memories associated with that night and I hate feeling the weight of someone's life in my hands. I don't know how paramedics, firefighters, doctors etc. do this on a daily basis. I just wanted to vent somewhere. It's been a day. Edit. There are many many comments, but I just want to say that I have read them all. I'm so sorry so many people have similar feelings, but at the same time, it is nice in some way to know I am not alone in them. I don't know a single other person in real life who has gone through something like this, so it has long been very lonely. Thank you everyone for your kind words, resources, and reassurance. I'll keep pushing forward, and I hope everyone else experiencing this can too. Here are the top comments, plus Opie's reply. Speaking as someone who had some similar experiences, it fades and you contextualize it better over time. Basically it gets better. I think a lot of people have things they think are helpful to say in terms of praise and bravery and whatnot. Or sympathy. I remember that stuff didn't really help. Maybe just the knowledge that it won't feel this raw forever will help. OP replied. That is indeed reassuring. Thank you. I'm trying so hard to push on. You're handling it well. Keep up the hard work. At least you didn't fail at saving him. That would have been much worse, I think. OP replied. I'm definitely grateful for that. But until he regains autonomy and can reasonably live his life, it's sometimes hard for me to feel like I did enough, even if that is silly. It's a very weird and distressing feeling. Like constant limbo.